previously on Amnesia. So now we can destroy this thing and finally go to the other side. <laughs> I'm gonna die! And now I just forgot about it. I forgot. Ah! <laughs> I have the first lever. Guess I have to find the others. Hello, my dearest. It's me, Kitty Saki Jackie, and welcome back to Amnesia the Dark. Descent. Hello. Okay, we're going this way. Casper. I saw you moving. The fuck was that? My journal is gone. What would they want with my journal? I don't know. Did you write something important in it? Is it? Why cockroaches? Get away from me. Ugh, disgusting. What is in. Ah. Uh. Drawer number one, drawer number two, it's empty. Okay. Door stuck due to a broken lock. Okay, I, I accept that. Why not? Excuse me. Thank you. Oil. Well, at least this room is not as scary as most of the rooms that have been on this house. Get away from me. Thank you. Maybe I should, maybe I should like record again when it's dark. July, 1839. I received a letter today from the Algerian governor's office disclosing the fate of Herbert's expedition. About a week after my departure, Abdullah, one of the men traveling with us, returned from the desert. He was badly injured, as if maimed by a lion. The man rambled deliriously about the expedition being attacked by something horrible. The French quickly dispatched a search party to look for the expedition. After searching for days, they found the camp abandoned without any trace of Herbert or his men. Tomorrow, I'll retrieve the things they recovered from Herbert's tent at the customs house. I don't know what to make of it, but I'm worried for him. Well, maybe something attacked them, Dad. Because they were not where they supposed to be. Uh, no. Uh, no. I have no idea. I should know. But I don't know. Can I remove that? Why can I remove some and not all of them? Anyway, I am losing a little bit of my touch because I'm getting, I need more and more time to record nowadays because my beloved neighbor doing so much. Ooh, crowbar doing so much noise. Are you hiding something from me? No. Nope. Ooh, letters. Yes. 3rd of July, 1839. Today I picked up Herbert's things at the customs house. I dug through the trove of documents he had carried found a log detailing the expedition. The nature of this text ranged from quick notes to colorful accounts of transpired events. I skimmed the pages, trying to figure out what might have happened. May 17th, the day I was trapped inside the orb chamber, Herbert dryly states, recovered Daniel after one hour of entrapment. This confused me greatly. I was suffocating within minutes. How could I have lasted an hour? I continued reading the peculiar text. Herbert states his facts without judgment or passion, but suddenly I could read frustration into his text. He pushed his men to investigate the underground tomb, an effort which seems to have strained the minds of his men. Madness spread through the ranks, and Herbert had to take some extreme measures to continue. He finally visits the chamber himself where he retrieves the orb to the surface. His account confuses me greatly. If he has the orb, what are those pieces in my drawing room? Exactly my thoughts. But you also meant that he got the orb complete and you have pieces of it. And from what I, what I remember also about what Daniel said, it's... Uh, he passed out after getting the orb and when he woke up again he had pieces so like was daniel responsible for what happened to her and his friends or something like his friends his co-workers and stuff like that anyway i don't know i need i need more information i don't have enough information um i think i can can I do that? Oh, I can. Okay. Uh, yes. My ear. The key. Please let it be here. 
That was weird. Let me see what, what it says. An important key is hidden in the gas room. Okay. Is it is it here? Like I mean <sighs> Okay. I am not here. You don't know what's going on. <sighs> okay. Can you go away, please? I wasn't expecting a monster. Please go away. Just please, just go. Did you go? I think he. I think he's gone. Is he gone? <sighs> yeah, he's gone, right? Right. Holy shit. I was not expecting any of this. 4th of July, 1839. It's done. The orb is assembled. I was awakened by an exhausting nightmare. Shaking and sweating, I retired to the drawing room with a cup of tea. The relic pieces lay spread across the table as I'd left them, but somehow I knew how it was supposed to be. I fetched the tar, which I had prepared to fix the pieces together, and without fault I joined them, producing the orb I remembered so clearly. The tar proved unnecessary. It was pushed out from the joining pieces as they merged on their own, with no adhesive. The ancient stone relic now rests on my table. Its immaculate surface and perfect shape could have been molded by a factory. This is all too strange. It is indeed. What is this orb? What does it do? And where's the key? Oh, I can light the fireplace. Oh, that's interesting. I'm looking for a key. Have someone seen a key somewhere? I just want to know as well. Why were they... Why were they there? Why were they looking for this orb or something? And like... I know there's uh, something to do with Agrippa. And I also know that I think Alexander that paid for all of this. I don't know, I'm just I just need to find that key that he mentioned. Oh, okay. Uh, I was looking Daniel. for the key. And... What? Still having nightmares, I see. Yes. I can't shake them. They come every night. We'll put a stop to them. You'll see. Okay. But I still don't understand why you two have like in com why why Daniel and Alexander I don't get it Oh oh I see oh, Thank God there it is I guess it is a good place to hide it then Aha uh -huh. interesting I, I I didn't know <laughs> I mean I knew it because like the only possible plausible place that key would be hidden it's like behind a goddamn paint right i've been trying to move every single paint in this room and i finally didn't want um well would you look at that i was I, I am moving a drawer get out of my way drawer i have important things to do right now um was this here before like a piece of dorso I don't like that I really do not like it it wasn't like a, a, a something that I could do with this to like move it I don't know I'm not going to do anything with this dorso anyway Ah, yeah, I forgot that I could go down there. 
Part of me is happy that I forgot, because I really didn't want to go down there, but it's okay. Let's, let's, let's go down, I guess. What is this, though? Storage. I don't like the storage. I get scared easily, so please don't scare me. Oh my god. I already hate this place. The darkness in the storage feels strange and unnatural. You think so? It is really dark in here. Thank you. Can I... I need more light. There is not enough equipment. Do I want to go down there? I don't I don't think I want to go down there. Let me try to make this like a little bit more bright. Ah, much better. There we go. Now it's now it's habitable. Now I can actually stay here. I like it. Holy Christ. That's goddamn dark. Well, I like that. Tinder boxes, thank you. How about that? A drool. <gasps> oh, it's right there. Don't look at it. 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 It's okay. 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 It's not okay. It's not okay. Don't kill me. Oh, he's right the fuck there. Oh, he's right the fuck there. Is he gone? No, he's still there. Let's just kind of walk without looking. Like this. Isn't it beautiful? Oh my god. Mm. Okay, is he gone? I almost don't have oil left. Okay, it doesn't appear to be here. Sir? I would like to know where you went so I can go to the totally opposite direction. I was supposed they went to that dark place, so I am going to this dark place. Oh, look at that, how beautiful this is. <laughs> I'm not scared at all. It's your imagination. You're scared. I'm not. Hello? Is this place safe? I hope it's safe. Is this oil? Primary. The valve is rusted shut. Okay, it's not oil. Hello? Okay. I don't know. What is that? I don't know. What is this? A drew part. Okay, I have a Drew and a Drew part and Tinder boxes. Beautiful. Can I combine them like this? Oh, there's still one piece missing. Can't assemble the Drew yet. I need to find the parts first. Okay. Um, well, they are not here. Let's see on the other door on the other side. I'm trying to go as fast as I can as well because like, I, I don't want to run out of oil <laughs> and be left in the darkness to die, you know? Anything important here? Yes, tinder boxes. Tinder boxes are important. Regarding explosive mixture. Alexander, I have prepared the explosive you needed for cleaning the floor drain. I can't stress enough how important it is that the mixture is handled with care. Please try to tell your father, your feather-brained servants this, this before you go ahead with your plans. The liquids are not by themselves explosive and should be kept separated to avoid further mis mishaps or mishaps, I don't know. I have arranged two large vats in the next room for the ingredients. All you need to do is mix the liquids and you are ready to go. Agrippa. Okay, I know how to make explosives now, I guess. Thank you Agrippa, it was very nice of you. 
Well, I went there and I went there, so let's go here. Jesus Christ, it's dark. It's so dark. Excuse me. I don't have tinder boxes for all these things. Well, they keep giving me tinder boxes, but like, oh, oil, yes. Thank you, and laudanum. Laudanum, oil, what else you have for me? Tinder boxes, perfect. More tinder boxes. Oh my god, game, I love you. Okay, I need to light this room a little bit. So then I don't need to use my lantern that much. Well, that gave me shit, didn't it? Oh, secondary. And this is primary, right? Let me light this thing. Primary. Okay. So I guess I need to find like oil. But another type of oil. So I can open up those things. Okay, makes sense. Let's go to this door. Oh, thank you for the light. It helps so much. And more tinder boxes. Oh, are you hiding from me, mister? I got another drill. Okay. Um. Right. Oh, I already have the chemistry part. I made a drill. Alright, I think I know what I can do with those then. But if I mix those things into the pot... Won't like fucking explode every single thing around here? Oh uh, no, let me see. Boop. Beautiful. Yeah, I have some. Can I get it back? I cannot get it back. I got it back. Okay. Now let's go to the other side and hopefully... It's not going to explode in my face once I do it. Like this. Yes. And like this. Great. Now I have nitroglycerin. I got explosive. You're not coming here, are you? I hope not. Okay. Let's suppose that you're not. I'm going back upstairs. There's a lot of stuff under the stairs here. I remember you were here before. So I imagine that you went this way. I cannot see a thing. Please, let me go. I won't tell anyone, I swear. I just want to go home. What have you done, mister? Okay, uh, th there's a door. This door won't budge. Amazing. I don't know if I want to go. You know what? That's uh, just like, you, you stay here. And you can uh, kind of help. Just like. I hope it's not the ghost of the lady that is stuck in that door. And is going to come and hunt me. For like, making her stay there. All right, I guess I'll just have to explode this. Machine parts. Well, guys, hold your horses. Uh, is it going to explode by itself or do I have to throw something at it? Uh. I'm sorry, lady. Oh, yeah, that's all I needed to do. Beautiful. Oh, that's pretty cool. The steel doesn't budge. I'm sorry, ghost of the lady. There is way too many ghosts here. Way too many. I absolutely hate it. Please stop moaning. I really don't need you moaning in my ear right now. Just like, just don't. 
Oh my god, do I have to go? I guess. Hello? Why are you doing this? Get away from me! Food storage. Okay. Yes. It looks lovely. I need more tinder boxes and lanterns. Not lanterns, but like holy shit, it's dark. Oh ghosts, please. More do you cry. Uh, scary your uh, sc scared I get. Can I have more of those? To, like light up the place. I don't know how long I'm going to stay in those places that I light up, but I think it's better than to just like keep wasting my oil. Don't cry. You're just making me uncomfortable. Oh my god. Well, that's disgusting. I know, I know. It was scary on the first like two times that you did it. Now it's just not that scary anymore, you see? Guess I'm wasting oil to get oil. Let's close that door. It's useless. Now let's try another door that is going to be useless. It, you know, useless, but useful. This. <gasps> okay! Fucking run! <sighs> really? That, that needed to happen. Like, I opened the door and he's just like, Hello! <laughs> Shit. Well, is... Is he coming? Hi? Is he still there? Okay. I think he's gone. So let's try again. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Like I, I just opened the door. He was just here like, Hello! What was so important in this room that you were protecting, sir? Scares and tinder boxes. Ooh. I'm Running completely out of oil. This is not good. Okay, let's go. What is what is here? Machine parts. Is this the right place to go? Yes, I guess. Yes, it is. Okay. I guess she was dragged and then murdered right by here. Who was she and why she was murdered? I don't know. Can I light more stuff? Oh fuck! I would appreciate if you did not do that again. Right, I burnt my hand. That was lovely. Is there anything else in here that I need? <sighs> was it necessary? Shit. Like, I'm not even being mean to you and you're just being completely mean to me. Oh, good. If a full set of three rods is unavailable, there is one rod in the inner study room which might work in case the elevator breaks down again. Unless it is absolutely necessary, always use the spare rods in the storage before using the mended one. Now I don't know where you are. I don't know where he is. I just heard him, but I don't know where he is. Ow, my eye. Okay, I guess I can go. Oh god, I thought I thought he was there. No, he isn't. 
Is he? He looks fine. Is he okay? I guess it's okay. I don't think he's going to kill me right now. No, I'm fine. Alright, I have the... He's right fucking there! Right where I'm supposed to go! Amazing. Oh, he's coming back. I don't know why I'm doing like this as well as if I can see he's coming. He's coming, he's coming, he's coming. I'm gonna hide. Maybe I can go around him somehow. Yeah, like if you went to the left, maybe I can go to the right. Don't look at him, don't look at him, don't look at him, don't look at him, don't look at him. There we go, good girl, good boy, I don't know. I'm Daniel, right? So I'm a boy. It's okay, it's okay. Just do not look at it. See, perfectly fine. I nailed it! Nailed it! I am great! Now I run! I run for my life! <gasps> oh no, you did not hear me! Holy shit, how many of you are there? Oh, it doesn't budge. Are you serious? You were there, now you're there! He's still there. He's still there, he's still there, he's still there, he's still there. Oh, he's there. He's right there. He's right fucking there. That's a fair! Okay. Maybe I can pass him somehow? Question mark? Okay, let's just stay very quiet this time. Instead of running for my life. That was that got me so off guard. Like I thought I thought I run away from the first one and there was the second one? I did not expect a second one. Okay. I guess I guess I'm fine. Now I'm scared to run. Okay, I can run. I can I can definitely run here. Oh. Lovely. Yes, ghosts and monsters and stuff. You know, I I I never want to go down there uh, again. Let's pretend that ever happened. Nice. Now everything that was beautiful is just stretched. Don't forget your bag, Daniel. I won't, Herbert. There is no shame in using a parasol in the desert. As it happens, it's imperative to your survival. But it looks ridiculous. The shame will hurt much less than dying, I assure you. Well, isn't that just lovely? All right. It is with this terrifying view that I am going to end the episode. Yeah, I'm gonna end the episode right here. It looks beautiful. <laughs> I have to say, I, I love that part. I was not expecting the second monster and everything was just like, <laughs> nailed it, oh shit. It was just like, mm, I love it. Uh, anyway, if you enjoyed this episode, leave a like to let me know that you are liking what I'm doing. I don't know, if you're liking the game, maybe, and if you like the cropped commentary that I have. Anyway, if you like the video, leave a like. Uh, subscribe for more. I play a lot of games. I love horror stuff, and the story usually are pretty good. So subscribe for more, and uh, leave a comment. 
tell me what you think. I don't know. If you think I could improve, just let me know. I would love to hear what you have to say about it. And uh, yeah, that's it. Hope you all have a happy ever after. And I'll see you on the next nightmare. Bye-bye. <laughs>